Gauss's divergence theorem. The theorem states that the surface integral of the normal component of a vector field taken around a closed surface equal to the divergence of the vector over a volume enclosed by the surface. Let imagine uh, this is a tunnel. Tunnel and the V with the velocity and this is a vector this is also a vector so v dot ds v dot ds measure the flux of the vector b that is the amount of liquid flowing through the surface ds if we take integration surface integration then this is the total or net fluid outflow through this surface all surface again in divergent we also know that del dot v dv gives the net outflow of the liquid through small element dv so for all volume element this is the net outflow so this is actually Gauss's divergence theorem that is this is uh, this equation comes only for a vector b and uh, for non compressible like uh, fluid uh, for a in general let the vector equals to a then the Gauss's divergence theorem states that a dot ds equals to the divergence of a volume integral of divergence of a del dot a d v so this is the Gauss's divergence theorem let we are going to solve a numerical problem In our previous problem, that is the problem of surface integral in direct method, we have uh, derived r dot a n unit and ds with a direct method um, for for the surface for the surface of a q bounded by ax equals to 0 plane ax equals to 1 plane x y equals to 0 plane y equals to 1 plane z equals to 0 plane and z equals to 1 plane so this is a unit q means that i uh, r is 1 because the x um, comes to 0 to 0 0 to sorry 0 to 1 y 0 to 1 z 0 to 1 so if we do make a surface integral or calculate surface integral in direct method we know that in previous problem this is a large about three or four pages but using the Gauss's divergence theorem it can be solved easily that is r dot n unit ds or surface integral equals to divergence of del dot r that is in this case vector is r sorry del dot r dv this is the volume integral so del dot r equals to and del equals to i del del x plus j del del y plus k del del z dot r r equals to x i plus y j plus z k dv that is integration of del del x y i dot i equals to 1 so first it should be 1 plus 1 plus 1 dv that is 3 dv so 3 v so for
so just like a previous problem in surface integral we also calculate this in previous problem so this is too easy this is about two lines this is our answer thank you